All right, the last race for me this week is the Hopper Garden Handicap at Baden Baden, a one mile four event, 12 furlongs, 0 to 90 handicap for three years and up. One is Dolores Abernathy, Dan Hughes, Idol Vice, Patrick Hogan, Ridgewood, uh, Craig Bedworth, Roaring Forties, Martin Leadham, National Guard, Obi Wan, and Citizens Drums, Stu Gray. Six horses in this uh, handicap here at Baden Baden. The penultimate race of the day, uh, the big one. It will be from Japan later on, and Martin Eden will be there for that. It says Lawrence Abernathy the Grey. It gets a good break from uh, up on the outside at Rory and Fortis and there's Lilac White Stripes. The second of the Greys in the yellow colours, the yellow cap is a uh, National Guard for Obi Wan. The yellow colours are the black cap, that's uh, Patrick Hogan's uh, Adelweiss. On the outside of these is a uh, Citizen Drum for Stu Grey and Ridgewood at the back of the field. They pass the winning post for the first time here at Baden Baden as Lawrence Abernathy takes them along. So the Grey horse leads uh, from the second of the Greys, uh, National Guard for Obi Wan. They're followed by uh, Citizen's Drum. They're followed by uh, Roaring Forties is on the outside of um, Patrick Hogan's Idlevice. Ridgewood is trapped five wide at this stage in a six-horse field. Amazing. As the Dolores Abernathy leads from National Guard in second. Citizen's Drum just behind that. Then comes Idlevice. He's on the inside of Roaring Forties and Ridgewood at the back of the field with his white cap and white steeds and the blue body for Craig Beckwith. So the all blue colours of Dolores Abernathy leads from National Guard in second. On the outside of National Guard is Idlevice. Then comes a Citizen's Drum. Roaring 40 is just behind these and Ridgewood at the back of the field. They've got about six films left to travel here as Dolores Abernathy, a comfortable leader for Dan Hughes from National Guard in second. On the outside of National Guard is Citizen Drum. In between horses, the third of the greys, Idlevice. And then comes Martin Leedham's Roaring 40s and Ridgewood still at the back of the field for Craig Beck with as the lowest Abernethy leads for Dan Hughes. So Dan Hughes and Craig Beckwith are in line for the fight now the trainer title this season. Their first and last moment in this race as the lowest Abernethy leads but National Guard is moving up onto the outside of the lowest Abernethy. Then comes Citizen Drum has been pushed along to try and prove on the inside this is Idlewise also pushed along to try and get closer as Rory and Forges in the back of the field Ridge already struggling. It's the lowest Abernethy for Dan Hughes who's, who's kicked for home early yeah the lowest Abernethy from National Guard in second and then comes Idlewise and Citizens Drum roaring for his behind that. Ridgewood has no chance. It's Dolores Abernethy stretching from the front. Yeah, it's gone about four lengths clear of National Guard in second. Idlewise has moved up into the third. It's the three greys left to fight the side, I think. Dolores Abernethy there is a useful advantage with a fur and a half to travel. It's Dolores Abernethy from Idlewise and National Guard. Dolores Abernethy is starting to get wary and here comes Idlewise. He's thrown down a determined looking channel. Dolores Abernethy. Idlewise comes to pick up Dolores Abernethy. And as Idlevice is drawing clear, Idlevice is going to win from National Guard in second. I think Roy Forties is probably going to get fourth because Doris Abernethy held on for third. So another one for Patrick Hogan. Idlevice leads a procession of greys in the end. Idlevice wins from the, from the second grey noise for field uh, National Guard. The third grey, uh, Dolores Abernethy back in third. And fourth was Roaring Sands uh, for Martin Needham. So another winner for Patrick Hogan with Idlevice winning the last from Baden-Baden.